My name is Gina Elise, and I'm founder of nonprofit organization Pinups for Vets, and we produce World War II style pinup calendars that raise thousands of dollars to support our troops and our hospitalized veterans. We dress up like 1940s pinup girls and deliver our calendars as gifts of appreciation for the hospitalized veterans. Um, We're going to do a glamorous makeover on Miss Katie, and it's going to be a really fun day, and um, hope to pamper her and make sure she has a, a really, really great time. I'm Catherine Robinson, and I was a captain in the Army. I was actually a battle captain in helicopters and stuff, so that was pretty neat. During my deployment to Afghanistan, I ended up cutting all my hair um, and donating it, because I, I lost um, quite a few of my friends over there, and I didn't really feel okay anymore looking in the mirror. I just felt like I wanted to give back. One of the things that I promised myself before I got in was I would stay in until the end of Don't Ask, Don't Tell. I was in Afghanistan, it was the end of the policy. I was like, you've got to be kidding me. It was the craziest thing ever. It was the very same time where I found out we were actually implementing the changes. They were like, okay, it's going to be this September and stuff that we're going to implement it. And I was like, oh my gosh, this is amazing. And then um, my friends died and everything. And I immediately, when I came back from r, &R it was like all around the same time all of this was happening and I just decided, you know, I think I've done my time. I think I'm, I'm okay to leave now. What do you miss the most? Uh, my soldiers. You know, these are my friends and, you know, these are my brothers and sisters, you know, so whenever there was a horrible firefight or anything like that, whenever my guys came back, I'd give them a hug. <laughs> it was like the biggest thing, like I'd give them like a bear hug. I'm like, don't do that to me again, you know, <laughs> like that kind of thing. I guess it's like a mother with her cubs. These were the guys that like would tease me and stuff like that. I mean, they're, these are big brothers, you know, like your brother teases you, you know. I'd ask one of my guys, he's like, hey, can you pick me up a sandwich and, you know, just give me some extra pickles and stuff. And so he ends up giving me this sandwich with this pile, huge pile of pickles, <laughs> and then like a chocolate cake and a slab of peanut butter. Like, it was the most random. And yet here I am, like even though like this seems so weird, I'm actually eating bits at a time and just slipping in my face. So I'm trying to like, because I'm briefing my pilots and I'm like doing the stuff with the missions and I have no time, so I'm just trying to like eat. And my pilots come in and they're like, oh my gosh, ma'am, congratulations. How far along are you? <laughs> and I love being in the military. I love my service. I have no regrets you know, being in the service. But, but I was happy to get out as well. I thought, all right, well, now I have to live my life and be happy said I wanted to do something, so I thought the smallest thing I could do is to donate my hair, you know? And so I, in honor of that, yeah. Was it scary for you to get it cut? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> See the big scissors? Oh my gosh! I was like, yeah, let's do this, let's, let's just do it, alright, alright, I'm good. You know, they braid it and stuff, and it's like the first step, I was like, <gasps> <laughs> And like, you know, like cutting my hair, cutting my hair, and finally like, the wo like one of the women that was watching, she's like, she's not breathing, she's not breathing. <laughs> <laughs> Do you wear makeup too? Oh uh, yeah, I do. I keep it very minimal, natural, minimal, yeah. natural. Yeah. Not today. Not today. <laughs> <laughs> you can do that for a while though. Mm -hmm. What happened? The cat I like. Mm -hmm. That would be perfect if I just been like, <laughs> nervous, but I feel beautiful. It's a weird feeling. Yeah. <laughs> yes, exactly. Exactly. And you can just kind of rest um rest the other one like on your side. I'm trying not to fall. Yeah, no, you're doing great. Yeah, 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 there you go. Exactly. Okay. 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 There we go. Beautiful. There you go. That's beautiful. <laughs> Alright, yeah, perfect. Amazing. Amazing. Yeah, trying to do that. Yeah. And then keep that in. Okay, let's outfit change. Okay. Push out. Back and forth. Back and forth. Beautiful, Sage. Beautiful. <laughs> Oh wow, what a shot. Stay right here on the blue dry, so that's it. Or in the side of the mouth. Come on. The 
This has been an amazing experience. I couldn't have asked for anything better. Honestly, I've never looked at myself in the mirror and thought I was beautiful before, so this is a... <laughs> I'm gonna cry and I have fake eyelashes on, so that's probably not a good idea. I just wanna thank everyone from Dina, from Pin Ups for Bets, and Dina to keep the show. Thank you so much for everything, and this has been an amazing experience, so thank you for making a vet feel beautiful. <laughs>